Hey, this is Ish. Are you tired of having to adjust or add an effect to each individual clip? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to apply the same adjustment or effect to multiple clips by using an adjustment layer. I'm gonna start by going to guided mode because in guided mode, they have a guided edit on how to add an adjustment layer. So let's walk through that real quick and then I will show you some other details about applying an adjustment layer. So I'm in expert mode, I'm gonna go over to guided and underneath guided basics, they have add an adjustment layer. I'm gonna select that. So it's gonna bring me back over into expert mode. It's telling me to click on project asset. I'm gonna select project assets and it says click on panel options, new item, adjustment layer to add a new adjustment layer in your project assets. New item, adjustment layer. So it added an adjustment layer here. And now it's telling me to drag and drop the adjustment layer onto the video to track on the timeline below. So now I'm gonna drag the adjustment layer to the video to track. Next is telling me to hold the trim handle of the adjustment layer and drag it to cover all the media you want the adjustment layer applied to. So I'm gonna drag this down to the end. It says select adjustment layer and click on adjust at the top right of the screen to open the adjustment panel. So it's giving me the arrow as a prompt. I'm gonna select it, so I'm going to expand it. It says click on any temperature or tint preset to apply the changes. So I'm gonna select this one. Now it says click the play button to see the results video has that tint over it. So it says click next when done adding your adjustment. You have learned how to apply the same adjustment to multiple clips. You can apply any effect from the effects panel on multiple clips using the same technique. All right, so now I'm gonna show you a couple more things to make using adjustment layers and Premiere Elements a lot more smoother that the guided edit doesn't show. So the first thing is I'm gonna go back to the adjustment tab, temperature and tint. So the thing to note is there's this eye here so the eye allows you to toggle on and off in effect. As you can see on the screen, the tint is applied. This is just basically a sheet almost is one way to look at it or a layer over the actual video clip. So if I want to turn it off, all I have to do is select. And when I select it, I go back to what is naturally there. So if I wanted to compare the look of the video with or without the temperature, I can just toggle this on and off again. And I'm going to click reset. So that's going to reset the adjustment layer back to normal. So if I want to add an effect to my video clips, um, I can go in here and then I can drag and drop an effect over to the adjustment layer. Is that it's created this dreamy effect now over all of my video clips. Say if I was talking or making a video and saying I'm dreaming about the beach. Well, now all of these three clips, which are beach clips, I got all the stock footage from Canva of the beach. So if you want to try out the Canva Pro license, in the description below, I'll link to a 30 day free trial of the Pro license, which is an affiliate link. But this allows it to basically have that dreamy effect on the video. So a cool thing that you can do with an adjustment layer is if you are familiar with keyframes, if not, I'll link to a video that I did that explains keyframes. What I can do is I can actually have this adjustment layer scroll or come over the video. So what I mean is I'm gonna to go to keyframes. I'm gonna to go to motion. I'm gonna to go to the position keyframe. I'm gonna slide it, set a keyframe here. And then this initial keyframe, I'm gonna have the adjustment layer be off screen. So I'm just gonna drag it off. So now I'm gonna have the adjustment layer basically slide over the screen. So this is a cool way to just add something different to your video and to show a different change or a change in the effect, literally sliding right over the screen. So that's one way you can use an adjustment layer. Last thing to note about the adjustment layer is everything that is below the adjustment layer is what gets the effect applied to. So say for example, I have my like subscribe button. So now if I, if I drag this to video track three, you'll notice that the adjustment layer does not impact it. It's gonna look normal. But now if I drag the adjustment layer to video track four, everything looks normal, but watch as the adjustment layer passes over it. Now the adjustment layer, because it's above video track three, it will get applied to everything below it. To summarize, Adjustment layers allow you to apply adjustments or effects to multiple clips at once. The adjustments and effect applied to adjustment layer affect all layers below it in your sync width. If you're new to my channel though, it's focused on travel experiences and fun. One of the experiences I share on my channel is my experiences editing and creating videos for YouTube. I specifically use this software, Adobe Premiere Elements, for all my video editing. If you wanna learn the basics and some cool tricks, I recommend you hit the like button, subscribe, and click the bell so you never miss another video. My name's Ish, and I thanks for watching.